Cheers. Pro tip, start every morning off with a dance party. Anyways, good morning. Scarlett is about ready to go to school. Today is Tuesday. This little guy will not let me put him down in the morning. He will throw a fit. He needs me to hold him all morning long. And you know what I say to that? There's gonna be a time where I can't pick him up. There's gonna be a time where he doesn't want me to hold him. So all morning long, I'm gonna hold this baby as long as he wants me to. I need to finish making Scarlett's lunch. She's having mac and cheese for lunch, so I need to get that heated up because we have the frozen Trader Joe's mac and cheese. Put a, um, like a heart emoji if you love Taylor Swift in the comments. Scarlett, I'm gonna go to Costco today. What do you want from Costco? Three samples. <laughs> what kind of food do you wanna eat this week? Applesauce. Applesauce, okay, what else? Give me the first, okay, what else? Those chocolate muffins. Chocolate muffins. Can I put you down just for a second? Put you down. Okay. For your own safety, you must be set down. Oh. I need to go to Costco so bad. My plan was to go yesterday, but then we decided to go eat Indian food instead. So I did not make it to Costco before they closed. So today's lunch of Scarlet's is kind of random. We've got mac and cheese, carrots, ranch, cheeses, animal crackers, and chocolate chip granola bar because this is literally all I have in my pantry. Benjamin Nyer, what are you doing up there? Go sleep. Go night. Night night with Sissy. Sit down. Sit. Oh, nice. Give Sissy kids. Oh, jeez. <laughs> Can we turn Bluey on? Okay, Scarlett just went to school. I'm about to turn Bluey on. We're in our Bluey era, and I am all about it because I love Bluey. I want to give a skin update because in my last video, I was like, oh, I'm having no issues with anything that I'm using. If you don't know what I'm talking about, I started Spiralactin like two weeks ago, and I started using a tretinoin cream. Good morning. <laughs> he needs a haircut. Anyways, um, I don't know. Okay. I had to move to a higher surface here because Ben keeps going for the camera. Anyways, the retinal burn has started to kick in, which is super, super common. Apparently, your skin just has to really get used to the retinol, and if you use it too fast, too quickly, it will literally like burn your skin. So I backed off of it, started using it like every two to three nights. My skin is probably the worst it's ever been, but it has to get worse before it gets better. Everybody I've talked to says, hang in there, it is worth it. You just have to make it through the purge. You have to survive the purge. <laughs> I don't think any of my issues I'm having with my skin right now are from the spirolactin. I think it's directly from the tretinoin. It's so obvious um, based off of everything that I'm reading and talking to people, it's the tretinoin. So what's been happening is my skin's been super scaly, super dry, which dry skin could be from the spirolactin, but I also really think it's from the tretinoin breaking out more. Today's like the first day I've put on a little bit of makeup. I put on some of my Typology Tinted Serum, which it's actually laying okay, but you guys can see just how badly I am breaking out. And for my own mental health today, we needed to cover some of that uh, the past few days, I've not worn makeup because it's just looked terrible. It looks worse on my skin than just letting my pimples live their best life. I've also been using the sandwich method, which has seemed to start helping as well. So you apply a moisturizer and then you apply the tretinoin and then you apply another layer of moisturizer. But that's my skin update for now. I'll keep you guys updated as the weeks progress. I'm really hoping here in a couple months I have the best skin I've ever had. I see it, I envision it, it's going to happen. I will have nice skin. I will be cystic acne free. Okay, I just got Ben breakfast. He's eating eggs and tomatoes. He's not really eating the tomatoes. Today's agenda, we need to go to Costco. I literally have no food. So I'm gonna clean out my fridge really fast to get that all prepped so I can stock it with all the Costco things today. So I'll probably include a Costco haul in today's video. And then also, surprise, surprise, we're gonna go work out, go to the gym. Okay, I just freshened up my hair. I'm now going to change, put my gym clothes on. And then we're gonna go to Costco and then we're going to go work out. That is my plan. But before I change, I have to show you guys this bralette that I'm wearing. It is so comfortable, so comfy. And it's by Skims. And you guys, you guys, I am partnering with Skims today. So I'm gonna share with you guys some of my favorite bralettes that I have from Skims. I honestly can't believe I'm partnering with Skims. This is a dream come true because this is a brand that I love so 
freaking much. I'm a huge fan of the Skims bodysuit. However, this time I wanted to try out some of their like undergarments from the Fits Everybody collection because I've heard nothing but amazing things about them. I have been on the hunt for a good, comfortable bra that's not a sports bra. I don't want it to be a sports bra, but I want it to fit like a sports bra. I want something that's gonna make me feel comfortable, but also confident and give me support after breastfeeding my baby. And let me tell you guys this, the Fits Everybody collection by Skims is everything I wanted and more. So I ended up ordering three different bralettes. This one is the crossover bralette in the color Onyx, and this one's probably my favorite. I feel like this supports my chest the best. The crossover style seems to work really well with my body. This little cutie right here is the racerback bralette in the color Sand. For summer, I have a lot of tank tops that have that razorback style. So this one's gonna be perfect for all of those cute summer razorback tops. And then this one right here is the triangle bralette in the color sand. This one V's down pretty low. So if I have like a lower cut tank top or shirt or dress, this is gonna be the perfect option to wear with that. All of the straps are adjustable. This fabric is truly like none other. I've never felt something so soft and so stretchy. This fabric truly melts onto your body and makes you feel like you're not even wearing anything while also still giving you support. And I've never found anything like that so along with the bralettes I also got a few pairs of new underwear I have not worn these yet don't be weird <laughs> and I know what you're wondering are they as comfortable as the bras yes they are they are seriously so comfortable and I want to replace all of my underwear with the fit everybody collection by skims because it's that good so this cutie is the string bikini in the color sand it matches my little bralette, so if I want to have a matching moment, I can. And then this is a high-waisted thong. It's gonna come up a little bit higher, but these literally feel like you're not wearing anything. They're extremely comfortable. Oh, and one more thing. The sizes range from extra, extra small to 4X. But I truly felt like I would be doing you guys a disservice if I did not share this brand with you. I know most people know what Skims is, but if you haven't tried Skims, this is your sign to do so. If you are on the hunt for some comfy undergarments, some comfy intimates that are just gonna make you feel good about yourself, that are gonna be comfortable and supportive at the same time, definitely make sure to check out Skims. You can go to skims.com slash Caitlin to check out the Fits Everybody collection. And then if you guys do end up placing an order, I would really, really appreciate it. If you let them know that I sent you, you can select YouTube in the survey and then you'll be able to select my YouTube channel in the drop down menu that follows. So yeah, definitely go check them out if you're on the hunt for some very comfortable intimates. I cannot recommend them enough. Change of plans. I have this like strong urge to go have lunch with Scarlett today. I don't know why, like all of a sudden everything just started hitting me and I was like, oh my gosh, she's almost out of second grade and the school year is almost over and I've only had lunch with her a handful of times. And when my parents had lunch with me growing up, it was like the best thing ever. So I was like, you know what? I'm gonna go surprise her. We'll push back Costco. I do have my gym clothes on though. So Ben's taking a nap right now. As soon as I get out of lunch with Scarlett, we're gonna go straight to the gym, assuming Ben's awake, go get her workout in and then I will go to Costco after the gym. I brought myself a Fairlife chocolate protein shake my baby. I love these so much. I also have my water and I'm also drinking a probiotic half day tea. <laughs> drinks on drinks on drinks. It is a couple hours later now. I have been back here. Came home after Scarlett's lunch, got him lunch and now we're in the car heading to the gym. Ty's gonna walk and meet us there. It is gonna be almost 100 degrees this week. It is getting so hot here. I think in my last video I told you guys I thought I was getting sick but I never actually got sick. I think it was just allergies. I think it was because the weather was like up and down. It was cold and then hot and then cold and then hot. It's supposed to be 93 degrees later this week on Thursday and Friday. It's getting pretty toasty out. Anyways, today's workout's gonna be pretty light. It's like a light glute workout. It's kind of a deload day for me. Yesterday was my heavy workout. Today's my light workout. Tomorrow's another heavy workout. But it should be a good day, so let's go get this workout done.
workout complete. We did glutes, we did core. It was a good workout. We are at the gas station right now. Ty's inside the gas station, by the way. I don't think I mentioned that, but we're gonna run home. I'm gonna drop Ty and uh, Ben off. And I'm going to Costco. You guys, I tried to Instacart Costco last night because I'm like, you know what? Like, we really need groceries and it's going to be a big trip. Maybe it's like worth Instacarting. Oh, hello. I had everything picked Sunset out on Instacart right. and I went to go check out and I was like, I can't do it. Do you know how much more is going to cost me on Instacart? How much? Not only is everything more expensive, which I, I get that. Sometimes it's worth the convenience. It was going to cost me like $80 more Dang. with the tip, with the fees. So I was like, I couldn't do it. I couldn't do it. Um, so last night I was like, nope. Is Scarlett everything... going with you or is she staying home? I think she's gonna stay home. Okay, that's fine. I invited Scarlett to come with me, but she's I too figured cool she to come. I to stay home and play with her friends or whatever. And she does not want to come with me. She does too not want to cool hang out with mama. me. Too cool for mama. Dang. But honestly, like a solo Costco trip, nothing sure. slaps more than yeah. a solo Costco trip. This is 30, actually 31 and a half. Yeah, I was like, what, it's 30. So my entire workout, I could only think about one thing. Raisin canes. No, that one thing was actually some burros. Oh, you want some burros again? Oh, man. Dude, you're They're like beef and potato tacos. I'm not sure something different. So, so like the responsible thing would be to go to Costco and get dinner and cook dinner. But like some burros sounds so good it for dinner so good. tonight. It sounds it so, good. so good. Threw a t-shirt on, grabbed a little post-workout. Uncrustable. I'm sorry, but is there anything better than an Uncrustable? If you say there is, I'm sorry to tell you, but you're wrong because these are seriously so freaking good. And you have to eat them frozen. I don't make the rules, but they're better if they're frozen. So you have to eat them frozen. Okay, but seriously, they're terrible for you. I know, should probably make my own, but the convenience, okay? Anyways, I'm gonna eat this and drive to Costco. Let's go. And I'm back. You guys, that trip cost me, guess how much? Guess right now. Before I say it, take a guess. I got a lot of stuff. $450. That was a very expensive Costco trip. However, we needed to restock the freezer. We needed to restock the pantry. I needed to restock all the snack stuff. I had a lot of things that needed replenished. So I knew this was going to be an expensive trip and it was, but we should be good for probably the rest of the month when it comes to like snacks. I'll give you guys a haul as soon as we get home. I'm going to take the drive home. But first, <laughs> this is important. Costco has these new chocolate covered mangoes and they look amazing. So let's taste test them right now. I can't wait any longer. First of all, I love dried mangoes and I love chocolate. So, I mean, what could go wrong? It's a nice big piece. We'll just go with it. I gotta take another bite before I tell you. Mmm. Yup. Those are dangerous. It's gonna be a yes for me. I'm home. Let's do a Costco haul. We'll start with snacks first. Krispy Kreme wafer bars. Amara yogurt smoothie melts. You already know. Z bars, organic fruit and veggie pouches, mush, go go squeeze yogurt, Noka superfood smoothies, original grass fed beef jerky, and mango habanero grass fed beef jerky. They had this as a free sample and it was so good, I had to get it. Pure organic fruit bars, little bite chocolate muffins, acai and blueberry flavored chocolate by Brookside, dots pretzels. Okay, and then for bread, we have croissants. These croissants are deadly and king hawaiian rolls next we have fruits we have blueberries and raspberries apples and oranges pineapple bananas more produce we have baby spinach and mini cucumbers for some frozen items we have these super fruit organic freezer pops we have some frozen fruit this is the daybreak blend okay now this is like random things we've got some organic eggs maple syrup Another free sample got me. This is a truffle parmesan and black garlic seasoning. They had it on popcorn and it was incredible. So I had to get it. Five cheese tortellini, black forest ham for sandwiches, chicken. I love how these come in little individual packs. It's really easy to feed Ben these. Applesauce for Scarlett's request. For beverages, we have orange juice, milk, core power protein shake, honest juice for school lunches, and a big ass thing of Coke Zero. <laughs> I'm gonna go recruit Ty's help to bring all of this inside and we're gonna get all this shit put away. Costco's put away, Ben is in bed, and Ty, Scarlett, and I just ordered some burros. So I'm gonna end this vlog sharing this delicious some burros. These are beef and potato tacos. They are so good and then beans and rice. I'm also drinking a half day green tea. This is our probiotic tea. They're so, so yummy. Um, and then we also have salsa, chips. Ty got some random burrito, but we're gonna eat these. Call it a night. Thank you guys for watching today's video and I'll see you in my next one. Bye.